Let me know when everybody's ready. Good when you are. So what's the latest? Well, first of all, let me thank you all for coming out. Obviously, this is the uh, one year anniversary yesterday uh, of the disappearance of Myra Lewis from North Madison County. Uh, my office, as well as the FBI uh, Jackson office, continue to receive and, and uh, investigate leads that we receive daily. Uh, you know, this is a case that uh, we all wake up to every morning and go to bed to every night. Uh, we've uh, continued our investigation uh, for an entire year. At no point has this investigation been closed. Uh, it's been active uh, the entire time. Uh, there are days when we get leads, there are days that we don't. Uh, obviously, when, when you don't have new leads to go on, uh, it's perceived as being closed, but I can assure you at no time is this investigation closed. Uh, I would treat this as if this were my child missing and I'll be out there looking every day until we have a resolution uh, to the case. Uh, the FBI uh, has held our hand through this whole process. They have provided us with resources, manpower, uh, financial assistance uh, in the form of rewards uh, to help ensure that we have the tools necessary to locate Myra. Uh, unfortunately, to today's date, we do not have that resolution. Uh, but in no, no way does that mean that we're going to stop or that, uh, that we're at any point going to close the case. Uh, I'd be glad to take any questions, but uh, to this point, uh, like I said, we still receive these tips, uh, following them all over the country. Uh, Connecticut, Washington State, Florida, uh, Arizona, we've, we've checked them all with the assistance of the FBI and their, and their agents. So uh, we, we haven't gotten the resolution we want, but we've not given up. I'll take any questions you may have.